This is the new electric E-Class. The new Mercedes EQE debuts with similar EQS styling under the brand EQ from Mercedes. The Mercedes-Benz EQE 350 slots beneath the EQS in the range, mirroring the relationship between gas-powered E-Class and S-Class models. While it certainly looks similar to the larger EQS, the EQE is a bit shorter. The front grille is bigger and dips further down into the bumper, with illuminated TriStar accents on the AMG line model. The headlights are also sharper too, with unique LED accents, and there are several different wheel designs to choose from, including 19 and 20-inch aero options. Powering the EQE 350 is a 90.6 kWh battery pack, and a 215 kilowatt electric motor mounted on the rear axle that produces 288 horsepower and 391 pound-feet of torque. Rear-wheel drive comes standard, but 4MATIC all-wheel drive is available as an option, adding an electric motor to the front axle. A single-speed transmission manages it all. Mercedes-Benz quotes a range of 410 miles or 660 kilometers on the very generous European WLTP cycle, but don't expect those same figures to carry over to the US EPA scale. With that said, the EQE can still charge from 10 to 80% in just 31 minutes using DC fast charging. Unlike the EQS, the smaller EQE doesn't feature a rear hatch, but a regular trunk opening. We have seen it on the road and the proportions are more interesting than the BMW i4 or the latest Tesla models. The interior is equally futuristic, with light colors and the optional, ultra-wide hyperscreen that stretches over the entire width of the cockpit. The high-tech chassis features a four-link front and multi-link rear suspension and an optional air suspension. Built in Germany and in China, the EQE line launches with the EQE 350, rated at 288 horsepower from an electric motor on the rear axle. All-wheel drive versions with an additional electric motor on the front axle will follow, and their power rating will exceed 400 horsepower. Look for an AMG version too. In its competitive set, which includes the Tesla Model 3, the BMW i4, and the Polestar 2, the EQE aims for a higher level of sophistication. Yet we can't help but wonder if its power rating is quite enough to wow new customers. And, indeed, if it can match the needs of many current Mercedes-Benz customers who are perfectly happy with their gasoline-powered cars. We will find out when the 2023 EQE 350 reaches U.S. dealerships in mid-2022. Subscribe to Auto TV. Thank you for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.